Hello there everyone and welcome back. I am Bogmod and we are about to do some fishing in the world of the Legend of Heroes, Trails of Cold Steel. Oh, I see how it works. I just keep quickly hitting the button. So I got a sword tail. And it gave me some sepith. Getting some CP. Okay, let's keep fishing. Mm -hmm. That seems simple enough. A little more... Dif a little different to the... Um, uh, to ha it was well, it was simpler in the other games. <laughs> and there's a limit, so I don't have to worry about getting trapped here forever. But I'm getting points, which is good. I don't get the things, which is even better. It's kind of a, a thing that they do in, I mean, um, in, in the last game. Estelle was a big a big fan of the fishing. Caught one. Plus, free Sepeth. <laughs> yeah, we got the fishies. Not bad. All the sword tails. Alright, I can't go fishing anymore. That doesn't reset. No, it doesn't. Alright, well, let's have to keep an eye out for fishing spots. Hello, miss. This has become completely unbearable. As much as we come tonight, our bath, dinner, and sleep. What? He's convinced himself that I'm his personal maid? Can't stand him anymore. No respect the fact that you have everything at home. It's a nice place. Again, very roomy. I wonder if that's just the the style here in Aragonia. Let's get the room cleaned up for dinner. My home tutor show up while it's still a mess. Where'd my chair go? I have a feeling it's this lady. Hey, I saw a weird guy at the river earlier. He had a bucket and a long stick and was just staring at the water. I wonder what he was doing. I know what he was doing. He was waiting for a protagonist to come by. Alright, so there's that. My sister with the exceptions to Thor's. Sounds like she's got a busy month ahead of her. Maybe hang out with Kay will cure my boredom. Mm -hmm. Got to Tizel some more today. Still teach her to make fun of me. Of this yet. Get that she's just gonna tell you off again, don't you? Yeah, stop picking on the poor girl. Mm -hmm. Anything in the church today? Uh, student from Thor's been coming here to help us today. She apparently wishes to be a sister too. Okay. Odd choice. If you want to become a priestess or a nun, you go to a military academy. So our 50 wars passed in the old revolution to place. Form convenient now thanks to the invention of ordnance. But they remain humble even now. We must never forget to be thankful for the life they've been given. And humble. So then this is the way to the commoner dorm. Well, compare it to my place. No, okay, well, guess I won't be comparing it much to mine. If you're looking for someone, you're, you're probably out of luck. Almost everyone's gone. It's a free day after all. Can't let it go to waste hanging around in a dorm. That's right. Well, let's check out the noble dorm. They seem like the type who might be like, Mmm, our dorm is fancy. 
and my butler is under my feet. Personal service as well. Those servants are all very capable. She has always been amazing. One of the new arrivals, Celestin, is especially talented. But I could learn something from practically every servant here. Ooh, they even they let me in even. And they have a receptionist. Butler Celestin. Welcome to the upper class dormitory. His name would imply this is the dormitory for students. In classes one and two. I beg your pardon, but I cannot quite place your uniform. Ah, uh, the red uniform represents class seven. Nah, I have with your name, and then get seen the uniform. Congratulations on your successful enrollment. Are you ready to visit one of our students? Are you happy to call for someone for you? Oh no, just stopping by. Nah, said so. One of the family I serve is also enrolled this year, much like yourself. It might not be my place to say. But I do hope that you get along with the upper class students. But, but I'd like that too. Mm. She can pass through that a proper reason. Alright. Fancy, fancy. Alright. Thor's Military Academy. So, let's review what I've got to do today. Nope. That's not what I wanted. I wanted... Um... Right. Here we are. So, I've got to help Colette find her missing book. She's on the first floor of the Student Union building. I'm going to go to the Engineering building. And I gotta look at the old school house. Alright, well, let's start by. We'll head over to the, um. The library. See if there's anything new in the recommended reading section. Mm -hmm. Oh, a noble. Oh, you're here to read too? There's nothing like spending a free day curled up with a good book. I try to keep it down if that's your plan, you won't disturb anyone else. Fair enough. Meeting corner. Uh, no, I read this one, didn't I? Yes, I did. Mm -hmm. Lo and behold, there are an upsetting high number of older books out at the moment. The world for highest number, uh, our favorite second year, of course. I'll be getting quite an earful the next time he steps into this library. I wonder who it is. It's a second year student of some kind. So we'll scribble. What is it? Can't you see I'm busy sitting? Leave me be! That reminds me of my time at university. No one ever wanted to hang out and make the fun social times at the library. So this is the student union building, first floor. Pardon me, you're Colette from class four, right? You submitted a request to the student council? I did, but you're that guy from class seven. Did you join the student council when I wasn't looking? Nothing like that, I just decided to help them out with some of their work. The student council president told me to handle your request. Oh, so that's how it is. Wow, both first years seem so much more grown up than me. In class seven must be amazing. <laughs> it's, it's, it's no big deal. So, you wrote that you need help looking for your student notebook? Yeah, I've been looking everywhere I could think of since the morning, but there's no sign of it. And you're going to start looking right away? They said that if one person was able to help me, they'd send someone else to do it. Hmm, so why is all this arranged? Well... Oh, I'll do a request. Sure, you can count on me. Thank you so much. Uh, I think you need a bit more information to have any hope finding it. Where did you first notice you dropped your notebook? Right after school yesterday, when I went to borrow a book from the library. With your book, so I went to take it out, and I couldn't because it wasn't there. Yesterday, after school, got it. It was the last time I remember having it. Class is finished, and I was still in the classroom. I remember using it to take notes while I was talking with my friends, so I definitely had it then. 
So somewhere between the classroom and the library. All right. Stop anywhere on your way to the library. Uh, Camp Student Union. And then to the library. Okay. That's not too bad. Split up and search the main building and the area surrounding it, I think. Who mm. is there? Because they searched the library from top to bottom this morning. The roof drops out because Jazz said he didn't notice it when he was doing his morning cleaning rounds. Main building it is. Start with the classroom. Showcase so she already looked at her classrooms. So the halls and rest areas of the main building would appear. And probably on the second floor. You know what? Let's go do that right now. No dilly dallying. All right, second floor. Mm -hmm. So it's either going to be a glinty thing, or... Probably not the classes, she said. floor am I on? Ooh, would it show up on my map? Main building, first floor. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, what's that? Aha! That should be it. But I should check the inside, just to be sure. Check the identification field. Yay! I found her the book! That suit the book. I'm gonna go return it right away. Now that we can get back to finish exploring places. Oh, Colette! Did you find it? Yeah, assuming this is actually your notebook, why don't you just check it, just to be sure. Mm. You're right, it really is mine, oh thank goodness. It's the only form of ID we students have, so it's awful if I'd lost it. I just could have chewed my head off, I'd need to get another one issued. Thanks so much for your help, Reen. Sniffle, Oh, she's almost brought to tears. By the way, where did you end up finding it? Oh, you know, the sofa's on the second floor of the main building that people use as a rest area. It's from the gap between the cushions. Oh, I guess I did relax there for a while. Can not think of it? I think I dropped it when sitting down once before. I found my pocket that time, though, so I didn't end up losing it. But why would she... Well, she's got a tiny short skirt. I can see where it might fall out. What pocket do you put that notebook in? In my skirt pockets, usually. Little boys use their pant pockets, too. Hmm. Put it in the jacket pocket. We've got those? Yes, you've got... I can see two. You know, well, I guess those could may just be fake jacket looking pocket teams. Check. Oh, wow, you're right. I had no idea this was even here. Thanks for the tip. Show all my pocket problems. I want to know what my reward is. Here we are. A silver chain. An accessory. Hold on, I couldn't possibly. Ah, don't worry about it. I bought one for myself the other day, and I'm ordering two by mistake. Can't really use both at once, so it makes sense to give it to someone else who might be able to do something with it. Well, for sure. Thanks. Mm. Yay! I did the job. And I got a thing. So much for finding it. Time for some sweets. Sweet sweets. Oh, the sound decisions are made by a few directors behind the scenes. They're all very important people, but I've never had the chance to meet any of them myself. This academy, I'd sure love to try some of my husband's cooking. 
What do you've got? What do you've got? Cold juice tomato sandwich. Anything new from you, buddy? I think their free days are for relaxing. It's easy to end up using more energy than you normally would. It's something that'll keep you going throughout the day. Alright. Person mm -hmm. told me you'll be investing in the old schoolhouse. Make sure you're well equipped before you head in there. Got weapons, armor, medical supplies, anything you'd expect out of academy stores. Okay. Let's see, what do you got? We've got a Kazakiri. Which I believe is what he's equipped with. Yeah. Lambda Rod. So this is all the normal gear that we start with. I've got one of these Imperial Chronicles already. Okay, use us to customize equipment. Literature Club? Hey, it's Emma! Oh, this is like such a passive pressure. Writing novels and short stories together would be a lot of fun, too. Maybe this really is the club for me. Mm -hmm. And she's dragged her into the wonderful world of passionate young men. Whoa. Also, is that... Look, it's hard to see if I put it with the window. Yeah, you can see it right there. She's got that one curly wisp of hair just sticking right out of the top of her head. She needs to comb that down. Just club. Any luck, buddy? Uh, they're not exactly friendly if you don't have the pedigree they do. Play. They were sick, sick of the noble's snobbishness. Now the club is just him. Aww. Poor guy. Fishing club? Gone fishing, Kenneth. Oh, yeah. He did say he was going to go fishing. Question for you, what kind of pictures do you want to take here, Rex? Pictures of cute girls, of course. Like, I want to spend my summer in snappy perfect pics as soon as you clad babes. What more could a guy ask for? I fear for this club's future. Any pictures of, of, of babes? No. Nice shots, though. Unuse. Is Toa? Hey, Toa! Hi. Hello, Reem. You have a chance to look over the quests I sent to your dorm? I did, and they love doing them right now. Hopefully this will make, uh, take some of the weight off your shoulders. Mm. Get so many of them, there's no way we could handle them all on our own. Be tough, but good luck. Anyone else in here? No. Oh, oh, trophies. We got a magnet. Apparently there's a magnet trophy for her magnetic personality. Nah, um, this is, yeah, there's nothing up there for me because of snobbish noblemen. Mm -hmm. All right, next stop is, let's check our map. Fee's in the courtyard. There's the gym over there. So let's swing around to the right. Or the left hand side. Currently cleaning up the auditorium. Pause for keeping it locked up when no one's using it. If you want to use it for some sort of club shindig, you should let us know. Alright, it's locked. Hey, Yusis. Hmm, that might prove interesting. Is he looking toward the stables? If he's interested in horses. What are you staring at? Oh, sorry. The clothes. All right. Horses. First time I've ever touched a horse. They're really amazing up close. It's so docile. But at the same time, I can feel how strong it is. Taking like this one, have you? Oh, my horse is at the highest caliber. Having been Nord bred the Nord Highlands. 
Reject it. What would you say to a test ride? All right, and then went over here. Oh, they did join! Look at them in their uniforms. This Ferris girl isn't exactly fond of me. Hopefully, it's just my imagination. I've got to focus on practice on any. What do you want? Can't you see I'm busy? <sighs> Who cares if she forgives you? Let's see, I see Emily's enthusiastic about our new members. And last year, we were in the same position as they are now. So the nostalgic to be perfectly honest. Just by showing you the basics. No worries. Not it's going to be too difficult yet. Don't use an excuse to doze off though, because you'll be doing it right after. This will be Emily. Being bested by Cobbler is quite simply not an option. As the daughter of the Floral family, it's my duty to put Elisa in her place. Alright then. Yeah, that's a close off building. So then, let's go to. Yeah, let's check out the gymnasium. Which I believe has an event with. Simon Fan Allen apparently joined the fencing club, so they pay him a visit. It seems really busy right now. I want to interrupt. Maybe I'll stop by. I'm going to interrupt. Because that's what I do. It sounds basic, but relaxing your body and staring your opponent down could save your life. Not particularly glamorous, but good fundamentals can save you from the embarrassing accidents down the line. Got it? Yes, ma'am! Ah! No! Don't do it, Alan! Oh. I wonder how close I can get to this. Nope. The game will not let me impale myself upon his sword. We're not pretty close, though. But not quite. See, Patrick isn't just an old, he's skilled with the sword. Almost really that much better than us. Now, if you lose your focus with the sword in your hand, you're allowed to have one run through you. Right, sorry! Loggins! Why are you wasting our time practicing the basics? We could pick up where we left off yesterday. Sure, I'm not the only one who feels our draw was unsatisfactory. Shut it. In your first year, you do the basics. No two ways about it. Ha! I thought you were such a hothead that you'd jump at the chance! Very well. And I suppose defeating you so hastily would spoil the fun. So let's you off for now. Up you little shit. Yes, it is matching in a draw. But I think I have the grasp of everyone's general skill is here. This club should serve as an adequate way to pass the time until I graduate at least. Yes. Alright. Well, good to know they drawed. And we got the swimming pool. Got ourselves a great group of first years this year. Catch seems like he's really into learning. There's Laura, who I don't even need to teach at all. Of the ocean, so yeah, I'd say I'm a pretty good swimmer. That said, I joined this club to get even better. If Laura wouldn't mind teaching me some stuff, she's a noble though, isn't she? I think she'd mind if I just asked her for help. I don't think she'd mind. Whoa, look at how cool that second year with the blue hair is. I thought she was a first year. Checking out different sports clubs, but I think this one might just be the one for me. If I join, I'll be able to get as confident strong as she is. Is she confusing Laura for a second year? She is! Alright. Well, since we're going to do an event with Laura, we will uh, do that next time. Thank you all for watching. Um, yeah. I definitely think I like Laura more than Elisa. Elisa's a little too... Traditional anime type lady in some ways. Anyways, uh, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe if you enjoyed. I'm going to share your thoughts. I'd love to read them. Feeling generous, you can always follow me on Twitter or check me out on Patreon. Talk to you later.